In just a couple clicks, you can have a month's worth of designs and posts for LinkedIn, Instagram, or anywhere you're really trying to push out social media for either your business or for clients. So I'm gonna show you how to do that exactly in Canva Sheets. It's super easy. So let's go to canva.com. The first thing you're gonna do is gonna click here. Now, you're gonna select Sheets right here. When you collect Sheets, you're gonna choose a different sheet you wanna start with. Now they have different designs. We'll just go with the social media calendar for now because we're gonna be focused more on posts and things like that. Now we're gonna get started. So we're doing it for a law firm. So I just named it Galadari Law Firm. Now this is actually a really good starting point because it gives you ideas of how you could post for a schedule. Now, whether it's for your business or you're doing it for another business, this is a great visual for like a client that you're gonna be working with so they really understand or for yourself to stay on top of this stuff. It actually comes with a date, but let's say you wanna change this drop down. This is the main portion we're gonna use here in Canvas Sheets is this action button. A lot of stuff you can do here, but for this drop down, let's say we just want to go here and add a drop down, insert, you can insert dates, links, but let's do drop down. They have different drop downs already in here, but you can create some of your own and add those in there as well. For now, we're not gonna really touch the drop down here, but we're gonna come over here and we're just gonna create, let's say we're gonna create our own. We're gonna keep visuals because we do wanna have visuals, but let's say we're just gonna change these and we're gonna take these completely out. This whole section, we're just gonna delete this section here. So we're just gonna delete, right click, and then clear section. You can actually delete columns, delete rows, but I'm just gonna clear this section, clear section again, okay? So now it cleared everything for us. Now we're gonna do this, is gonna we're gonna keep this as our visuals. So we're actually gonna clear these out too, because we're gonna create our own custom images here as well. So we'll clear that section. And now here, I'm just gonna put like the copy, right? This is gonna be the copy that's gonna go on our photos. Now for our family law firm, what we're gonna wanna do is actually add in common questions that people are asking. So I'm just gonna highlight this role and I'm gonna go to magic, click on actions and go to magic right. Now here, I'm gonna give it a prompt. So say for example, I'm gonna say you're a marketing expert remember on any prompts you want to give it a role and what they are right you're a marketing expert coming up with ad copy for a family law firm add in frequently asked questions with common answers and have some call to action that'll be the prompt and then we'll just hit it and now it's going to generate those common questions right and we're gonna view this, see if we like it. Take most case resolve in three to six months, but every family law, every family is unique. For personal guidance, contact me or visit. Okay, perfect. So I like this. From here, I'm just gonna enter and it's just gonna fill it right in. So now we have this filled all in with our prospective clients on what questions they would be asking. Whatever business you're in, that's always great posts and content to put out there is frequently asked questions people are asking. Now you could do more deep research. I just wanna go over how you can create 30 days worth of posts super, super quickly for your business. The next step is creating the visual based off of the copy here or the frequently asked question. So now we're in Magic Right. We have all of it highlighted. We're gonna put in a prompt and just say, now you are a designer, create a unique graphic based on the questions in column G. And now we're just gonna let that prompt run. So there it is. So it already came up with some photo ideas based off of the prompt that I put in and the questions. So I'm just gonna enter that and we'll finish that. So now we have the visual. Now the next step, what you can do is you could just go here and go to Magic Media. And then from here, you could just copy this and paste it in here and then hit generate image. And then that will generate the image for that section. And this is pretty good, right? Uh, granted, not 2014. <laughs> uh, but we'll just add one of these in there, right? So we can just add that. And then you repeat that process 
for the rest of the visuals, right? You could also create videos for that specific prompt. You do the exact same thing, magic media here, and then graphics, you could choose a graphic. So let's just do graphic, or you could choose a video off the same prompt. But let's just say the next one we wanna do a graphic, generate graphic. Now it has the graphic and we can add the graphic. And you would just repeat that for each individual one over and over. And you could do the same for video, but for this, we're just gonna keep doing this. So we're just gonna clear this prompt, hit paste, generate again. And then here, let's have the, the title, our firm name, right? So Galadari Family Law. All right, so the next step, what you're gonna wanna do is create or choose a templated design. You want everything to kind of flow off. So you just go to social media, and let's say it's gonna be Instagram post to start off with. And what we'll do here is we'll go to designs. I like this design, so we'll just use this design. And then I already know kind of, we'll put the visual here and let's actually move the visual down. And then we want kind of the, the law firm name maybe to be at the top, we'll get rid of this. And at the bottom here, we'll actually just create get rid of this stuff and then we'll create a title. So let's just create a title here. Let's just add that to the bottom and that'll kind of be our copy or what we're gonna add for the firms at the bottom and then we can just bulk create. I wanna make this a little bit smaller and then we'll put it here. All right, so then the next thing we're gonna go here and we're gonna highlight these cells that we have photos in and go to actions, bulk create and then you wanna make sure you select the cells because if I just had E selected, it's not gonna work if I just selected one visual here. So you actually wanna select the entire cells here to make sure it grabs them and bulk creates. So you go here, hit continue, and then you go with your current design here, right? And then from here, we're gonna put the, this, connect to the data visual, here, we'll connect to the title. And then from here, we'll connect the add copy. All right, and then we're gonna bulk create. So we'll just create designs. It'll come up with all these, de these designs really quick. And you'll go here, click on this. And then from here, Galadari Family Law. It'll make it very easy for you to replicate designs and bulk create and now we're just changing the size and there you go now we have posts that we could start posting on these frequently asked questions of course you can modify these designs as, as you'd like but now it just bulk created so you don't have to spend hours and hours and hours creating entire campaigns and it'll be all done for you and you can kind of preview what that's going to look like and you can play around with this till you find a design that you really like and then it's gonna bulk create for you. And it's that simple. 30 days worth of posts, even months worth of posts in a matter of minutes and making it very, very easy for you to edit. Let me know in the comments below what you're gonna use this for, as well as what you wanna see in the next videos. Well, I hope that was helpful. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.